after a fascinating four-wheel drive battle all weekend. It started with the power stage. You guys, oh so close, had pace all day. It just got away from you, but third for the weekend. Congratulations. Yeah, it was a disappointing finish. You know, we uh, had a good lead going into the last stage, but um, unfortunately, I don't even know how it happened. We ended up with two punches and um, dropped a minute, and that um, put us back to third for the day. It's disappointing, but you did debut with the car when you think about it, Matt. It's pretty amazing. I, look, I think it's fantastic. You know, yesterday was went really according to plan, and, and we weren't expecting to set the world on fire. It's a brand new car. You know, I was saying to Justin on one of the transports today, he, I think he's done about 6,000 competitive kilometres in an Evo 9, and as of right now, 207 in, in uh, the Hyundai. So, all things considered, I think it was great. You know, we showed some pace today, everything started to click, and uh, so close. It was, mate, and I think the other key part about it is you do really enjoy driving this car, only two days in. Yeah, the Hyundai have to be the best car I've ever driven. It's unbelievable, the handling, it's so nimble, uh, and it's great not to have a rear boot. <laughs> Marcus Scott, welcome, congratulations, you've won the second heat to finish second overall for this rally. It's been an amazing weekend for you guys. Yeah, well, um, it's really only just sort of dawned on us now, you know, we um, just kept plugging away today and had a good run through the last few stages. and and ended up here, so yeah, excellent. Now Scott, you were just saying before, it was only your second ever rally, so you, you've got the lucky uh, touch, haven't you? Uh, yeah, I don't know about that, I, uh, I go away while I'm a few times in the notes, but uh, <laughs> as the song goes, he's not heavy, he's my brother, so he's got to carry me a bit. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's worked that way, but it's not just a fluke or by any way, you had p genuine pace, you got onto the power stage as well, so you've been in the mix the whole weekend, I just think it's a great job for you guys. Yeah, no, thanks, um, you know, yeah, came here with no real expectations and, um, you know, to come away with second, we're, we're stoked. Winners, four-wheel drive of the National Capital Rally. It's Bernie Webb and, of course, Mick Patton. Fantastic job by the Repco Rally team. Two from two. Yeah, no, it was a uh, great end to a long day today. But, um, yeah, look, Justin had our measure uh, this morning and, and this afternoon, but we managed to get him on that last stage to take home the victory for the weekend. So, look, we're super puffed, uh, pumped, but um, really unfortunate for Justin and, and Matt, unfortunately. But... Um, you win some and you lose some, and um, yeah, that's that's the nature of the beast, unfortunately. It was another great scrap, wasn't it, Bernie? Four wheel drive. We were watching every stage. There was you know three or four of you who were dicing for it, so it was great to watch and be probably involved in. Absolutely. Look, it was a real fight to the end the whole weekend. You know, Richie was hard to get near at the start of the weekend. JD's been hard to get near today, so uh, we've just been. Uh, played our cards well I guess and, and managed to stay on the road for most of it and get through but uh, this is a really special uh, victory for me I didn't think about it until when we we're in service then but uh, you know I grew up out in these forests and spent my days uh, you know, out there spectating watching the greats the Possum Bournes the Neil Bates the Ed Ordinskys and uh, you know in the what was then the Rally of Canberra yeah. so to be able to come out here now and, and stand on the middle of the podium is, is a really special feeling so yeah. thanks mate <laughs> appreciate it and look he's been thanking you a lot because you bring a lot to this team doesn't he so it's probably nice a little uh, you know nice to be able to do that for him oh look it's massive and look we get along really really well both out of the car and in the car but we work well together and that's the main thing and, and we just stick to our guns and do what we need to do he didn't tell me that we had to win that last stage to win the, uh, <laughs> so win the weekend so yeah. uh, which is probably a good thing but but that's he knows what I need and I know what he needs and, and it just works so it's fantastic.